Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Marissa Explains It All. You guys, today is the day I am so excited. I can't be the only one who gets excited about new makeup like this. Like, I was sitting there eating my lunch and all of a sudden the FedEx box came and like, it's here and I'm super excited. Like, I drop my lunch, I run out, I'm like in a bathrobe, my neighbors are like, think I'm crazy. It's happening. And my husband actually said that. He calls up, is it happening? And I'm like, it's happening. And that happening is Wayne Goss's new lipstick has just arrived from FedEx um, in my little beauty lish pack. For those of you that are following new releases, Wayne Goss just released his first makeup launch. Um, he's had brushes out for years, but he has uh, just released a new line of lipsticks, lip glosses, and lip pencils. And so I was super excited and lucky enough to score one um, on the opening day. So if you are looking forward to seeing what I got, then stay tuned and I'll be right back. All right, so as I mentioned, Wayne did start a line and I'll just give you a few facts about the products before we kind of dive into the box, which I'm like dying to do because it's right here in front of me. So I'm gonna look at my phone, but um, he's got a new line of luxury cream lipsticks. There are 10 shades available from beautylish.com. I'll put the link down in the description below. They are all $28. And out of the 10 shades right now, as of this filming, there are only three left available. They did launch on Cinco de Mayo. So May 5th, and so they're um, just about all sold out. Uh, I did get one like 30 seconds after it launched. <laughs> I was on the little, my phone like refreshing, waiting for it to launch, and um, just like added to bag and hurried up and got it in there but so those are the lipsticks and i'll put some swatches here they're really pretty they mostly seem to focus in the pink and peach range he does have a couple of reds in here but there are a lot of maybe nudes and neutrals in here which i love that's kind of my whole thing uh, so i'm really excited about that He's also selling the High Shine Gloss. So he did come out with seven shades of a gloss. And as of this filming, there are two left available. And these all are a nice, like, um, iconic, like, shiny, really super shiny finish gloss. I did not pick any of those up. I just went with one lipstick just to see how it was. Um, and so then the other thing he came out with were five shades of the Essential Lip Pencil. And so these pencils are $14. And as of right now, all five are available from Beautylish. And so... The lipsticks seem to be really the popular thing that, that everybody kind of went for, and they're just beautiful. I'm really excited about those. Um, so let's see what I got. Um, I wasn't sure if it was going to be like, you know, another like lipstick gate situation. So I only bought one <laughs> just to see. So I haven't unboxed it yet. I have it here, and so let's see what we got. So right when you open it, it looks like it is a nice little package, and it is like cardboard with some tissue paper inside. So let's see what we get here. So black tissue paper. And then inside that black tissue paper looks like there is the lipstick. And then it also comes with a little bit of an extra. I don't know, I don't remember if I, I don't think I bought it. I think it must be a freebie. So this is a sample maybe of the Oribe Mystify Restyling Spray. Interesting. So I did not order this, but uh, that was really nice of it to come in the mail. So I'll check that out. But what I really want to check out is this beauty right here. Yay! And so it looks, you know, like a regular size lipstick, I'd say. And I did purchase mine in the shade Dahlia. And so I looked through all of the swatches and tried to figure out which one would be best for my skin tone. And honestly, they think they all would fit. They all would look beautiful. But I chose Dahlia because I just thought that would be the best one that um, I might like to wear most often. So right, right away, when you get it out of the packaging, it is a shiny gloss package. And so it does look like this and it has Wayne's name on it. So it has Wayne on the one side and then it's got Goss on the other. So that's kind of nice. He's got his own little shiny slick packaging there. Um, edges are uh, nice and square. It is a basic simple square package. It doesn't look like there's too much beveling. When you un, uh, uncap it, it looks like he's got his name there in uh, kind of embossed around the rim. And so that is nice. And then of course the shade Dahlia. And so it's just a traditional bullet press. It looks like bullet press lipstick. And this is what it looks like just in the packaging. And so I am going to do a little swatch here on the back of my hand and see what we get first. I shouldn't show my hands, like my hands are so veiny. It's a beautiful shade, I love it. So let's see now, just drop the box. 
So let's see now what it looks like on because I'm so excited to see how it applies on your lips because you know this is um it's a beautiful shade but it does look a little bit darker on your hand than it would look on your your face. Right away I can tell that it's actually a very creamy formula so I can tell that it's just really like sinking in and it feels very rich and luxurious so let's see what it goes how it goes on the lips so i'm gonna zoom y'all in for a sec so you can see a little up details up close okay so you are super close now a little too close probably for some of these lines but we're not going to talk about it all right let's see how this goes on yes this is so pretty i love this shade uh, it looks really pretty it is a pretty like really um peachy kind of pink uh, nude so it's very pretty it is has just the hint of like pink and like that I'm looking for but I really do gravitate towards kind of peaches and warm like kind of oranges in the fall and then in the summertime I gravitate towards kind of a coral so I do sort of always live in that like orangey type space or um, peach space so I really do love the mixture of peach and pink that he's put into this formula so there isn't really much of a scent to it which I appreciate because I'm not really a huge fan of a lot of fragrance and cosmetics so do appreciate that so so far I'm super happy with how this does I'm gonna see how this wears and I mean it is a satin finish lipstick so it probably will wear off when you eat um, it's not like a um, matte or a color stay or anything like that but it's a traditional lipstick with a satin finish but I am not expecting it to stay on forever but I like to see how it wears throughout the day I think the formula is great it's very moisturizing it seems very um, just perfect for what I need actually it kind of reminds me of some of the Mac cream sheen lipsticks um, that kind of pigment and that kind of feel to it so all right guys let me know what you think below in the comments and uh, if you were able to pick up any of these what you thought of the product have you picked up the lip glosses any of the pencils i don't think i need a pencil but i'm thinking about that gloss i might come back for that all right guys that'll do it for now thanks for unboxing with me and i'll see you next time bye